Digitech was founded in 2001 by three friends uh, that started with uh, customizing uh, PCs for gaming and uh, sold it to friends. Uh, later on, they added more electronic products to it, uh, grew in the online field uh, after they had no more space. And then in 2007, uh, they found this site here, a uh, uh, bacon steel mill um, that uh, had to be re refurbished. And uh, then uh, we grew until now we have about 70,000 square meters where we store not just electronic products, but uh, all kinds of products uh, that are not fresh food, but you can get by uh, diapers and uh, furniture, household goods, and all kinds of things. The challenges we had during the planning phase of the project was, first of all, it was to get the performance, and we wanted to stretch that to the max because we knew that the growth will come especially for e-commerce. The second challenge was to have a good accessibility within the conveyor belt system to actually ensure the good availability when we had to replace motors or conveyor rolls, something like that. During the planning phase, we had a very intense and good collaboration with Fondelonde. They reacted very fast to our needs and were also very flexible in terms of changing stuff in the layout when we asked them and that helped us a lot to actually get the best out of the whole project. The implementation phase was very fast, also very intense due to the short lead time. It went very well, we met all the milestones in the project plan and we went live two weeks earlier than originally planned, which is a great success. So when we went live, COVID hit and we originally planned to have a slow ramp up to check all the system, to check whether all the boxes reach their destinations. And we just forgot about that because we knew we need to move fast to meet demand because at that time when we went live, we had like five times higher demand in the system than we used to have and therefore fast acting was necessary and without the system and going live with that system we wouldn't been able to actually meet demand during that first lockdown phase. So even though we had a very fast and quick ramp up and couldn't check during that phase everything in detail the system performed very well um, also the availability is very high and it still is and therefore um, it's just a great system to actually meet our customer demand. I think the reason why we are number one in Switzerland is first thanks that we are Swiss and literally speak Swiss and are very close to, the, to this market. And of course, because we uh, have these short cutoff times, means you can order the products at uh, 9 p.m. and still have it delivered next day to your doorstep. Vanderlander, moving your business forward.